What's going on guys and welcome to another video. Today the army reset and with it came surprisingly new cosmetics and the return of special outfits the community has been waiting for for a very long time but let's get into it. Starting off with the free cosmetics you get when you log in today. You are awarded the splattered weapon skin for the storm gear, the m28, the ke7 and the gear which means each class gets this skin for a weapon. Now for the weapon skin itself it's of the common quality so it's not that exciting in my opinion but what it looks like to me is blood smear to the entire weapon and I find it kind of interesting but like I said it's nothing too special but at this point if it's for free it's for me. Now the next free item you get when logging in today is an epic tank skin for the panzer tank called dead of night. I find this one pretty cool making the tank all black. This is definitely beneficial to people who do not have a skin for this tank yet but again if it's for free it's for me. Now moving on to the new bundles or if you want to call it that that were added today I'm sure lots of people are very excited to see and finally get their hands on is defying odds bundle. All I can say about this guys is that you can finally obtain the Yankee and GI outfits for the US. Not only that, people that missed out on the German outfits such as the Storm Chaser and the Nosh Dagal outfits, now is the time to pick this one up. It's been a very long time since we've seen these cosmetics and now they're back for the first time in over a year. So my recommendation to you guys is anyone that has been waiting for this, be sure to pick this one up because it's hard to say when DICE will bring this back to the armory and I can't stress enough, do not forget about this one guys. Now for the second bundle, Trial by Fire, there's also some outfits here that you may want to pick up such as the AKA outfit and the Scrapper headgear. Now if you didn't know, you can actually equip the AKA outfit and the Scrapper UK headpiece for the US factions. These are not strictly for the UK, so just keep that in mind. The bundle itself is awesome, is one of my favorite chapters for Battlefield 5, and I enjoyed the weapon skins and the melee weapons you can get from that chapter. So if you miss out on this chapter, be sure to pick these skins up too and add it to the collection because like I said, you just never know with DICE if they will bring this back or not in the future. Now for the last bundle that DICE brought back, and obviously we were all expecting this, but at least I was, is the Halloween collection. They also reduced the price on this one, which is a plus for anyone that wanted to get the outfits in this one. In my opinion, the outfits are pretty cool and the epic weapon skins, especially the STG44, are very detailed and look awesome. But I find it a bit weird that DICE added the splattered weapon skins to this, simply we were already gifted this by logging in today and they weren't a part of the bundle to begin with when it was first released last year. A little weird, but this is back on the armory if anyone missed out on it, be sure to pick this one up too. Which brings us to the last few cosmetics that were added. There are two tank skins for the MK. These aren't too exciting, but if you're a tanker, I'm sure you enjoy these. But if you're going to pay 500 battlefield coins for one tank skin, I'd highly recommend picking up one of the new bundles since you'll benefit more from that than you would just the skin itself but anyways guys that pretty much just wraps up the video big armory update today i wasn't expecting also free stuff i definitely was not expecting but it is nice to see if you made it this far thank you guys so much for watching leaving a like really helps me out and i appreciate it also if you're new to the channel maybe check some videos out and if you like them maybe consider subscribing and i'll catch you guys in the next one